cool. We are on a call out for a suspected green mamba. When I say we, I don't just mean just me. Um, I'm with Miguel, who's designated driver, and we're out here on the south coast, so little rural back roads, and apparently there's a snake inside the house. It's gone into the kitchen, so we're gonna see what we can find. And hopefully it's not just a spotted bush snake, because we've seen just about enough of those this year. Go, cool, so we just got to the location, Miguel and I, and have a suspected Queen Mamba call. But we're gonna need the mamba bucket. The mamba bucket, um, let's, let me just grab a tongue, I think. Oh, let me grab this one. Okay, so let's go see. Oh God, it's just there, we're gonna, uh, he said it's under the fridge, but we know how that goes sometimes. Torch dead. <laughs> Let's see. Is there a light in here? Oh, probably not one that works too well. Do you want to help me? Let's just move this fridge out real quick. Ah, uh, there we go. It's really dark, but there's a there you go, it's a big green marble. Let's get some tools quick. Cool, so mom is under the fridge. Just gonna use the stick and try to get it out and not get electrocuted on the fridge element. Got it out, now it's tangled up in the enemy. Would you kill it? No, we're definitely not going to kill it. Ah, uh, what's we going to do with this? We're going to take it out and let it go. I. Yeah, it's just going under the fridge. I just got about the tail. <laughs> Who's about the rose of the reserve? I'm like, wait, I get. Here we go. Decent size green mama. Don't know how long he's been under that little fridge for. But we're just going to put him. <laughs> we're just going to put him in the bucket and we'll have a better look at him outside. Quick. Got you, Susan. Little on. And he almost shot right out of there. Yeah, he's not. There you go. I'm secured. And we just go have a look at him outside. Cool. So we're just going to show these guys whose house it was in what a green mamba looks like. Because they wanted us to kill it for some reason. That's healthy green mamba. Yeah. You don't have to run away. I'm not yeah. going to let him come close. That is big. What do we have? That is big. Okay, we have some game. Yeah. Yes, yeah. So where did you see it come from? It just, it just came from there. It just came from this side. Yeah. Then the dogs were chasing it and then it got inside. Sure. Lucky, lucky it didn't bite the dogs because the dogs would die. My son, get in front touch with it. Okay. What does that mean? This one. Okay. Okay. Okay, but we're gonna put it back now and then we're just gonna go take it and let it go somewhere safe. Alright, alright. Alright. Alright, so we've just finished getting some photographs and footage of this Eastern Green Mamba. 
I'm just gonna pick it up. You can see we're in beautiful habitat here. I'm just gonna release it and we're just gonna put it into one of these adjacent trees and we're gonna get going. Um, and like I said, the green mambas, totally different demeanor than the black mamba. You can see I've just got it here on the open end of this snake tong just to pick it up. He just doesn't wanna get out of this tree. But we are just gonna pop him in this tree here. And it's in amongst this deep grassland. So I'm actually just gonna give the snake the opportunity to do what it wants and go where it wants to go. Um, there's plenty of cover, there's a stream just along here. And there you go, Eastern Green Mamba.